Welcome to the world's greatest sportsman. Each week I'll ask you to um, vote in the comments box for each particular sport. The winners will go through and the two best runners up will go through to the grand finale where we'll find the world's greatest sportsman. This week it's footballers. So let's see who you want to vote for. Pele, one of the greatest players of all time. As you can see, scoring here his famous goal in the 1970 World Cup final. He was born on the 23rd of October 1940 in Brazil. He scored 1,151 goals, most of them coming from his time at Brazilian club Santos. He played 92 games for Brazil and scored 77 goals. He won 24 trophies at his time at Santos and he has won three World Cups in 1958 in Sweden, 62 Chile and of course 70 in Mexico where he got the golden ball for being the best player in the tournament. The only exception of when he didn't win a World Cup was 1966 and we all know who won it then. The second nominee, Johan Cruyff, was born on the 25th of April 1947 in Amsterdam, Holland. He played as an attacking midfielder slash striker. He scored 33 goals in 48 games for Holland. He scored 291 goals, most of them coming from his time at Ajax. He won the European Cup three years in a row between 71 and 73 which was also at his time at Ajax. In the 1974 World Cup in Germany, he won player of the tournament as captain of Holland, and he led them to be runners-up for the first time. And in the process, as you're about to see now, he created his own turn, the Cruyff turn, in a match against Sweden. It's in super slow motion, so you can see how he fooled the, key, the defender so, so well. De Kaiser, which translates to the Emperor, was a nickname given to the great footballer Franz Beckenbauer, who was born in Munich, Germany, on the 11th of September 1945. He was the first player to replay the sweeper position. He played 103 games for Germany, played in three World Cups, runner-up in 66, third place in 70 and he won as captain in 74. Won the Bundesliga five times and like Cruyff before he won the European Cup three years in a row between 74 and 76. The final nominee is Diego Maradona born on the 30th of October 1960 in Lanos, Argentina. He scored 311 goals in his 490 game career, club career. He played 91 games for Argentina, scoring 34 goals. He won the World Cup in 1986 where he considered where many people say he dominated the tournament more than any other player. But he will always be remembered for this. This handball he did in the England match. Um, in that in that World Cup in the quarter final, but he seemed to redeem himself by scoring what is considered to be the best ever goal, which you can see now. Diego Maradona is truly a legend. Here are the nominees one last time. So to vote, it um, you should send a private message to. Skull crushing finale, like it says below this video, and um, or if it's easier for you and you don't know how to send a private message, just put who you think was the best footballer of all time in the comments box. But I'd prefer a private message. Thank you for watching.